Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Mascara Monday. Today I'm going to be reviewing the new Rimmel Scandalize Kate Mascara by Kate Moss. It looks like this. Let's just cut to the clip of me applying it. what it is with Rimmel but they feel like they need to make their wands huge I don't I don't understand before getting to that let's just talk about the mascara so uh, scandalized by Kate Moss says volume and lift this is new no clumps and let's see broken heart shape brush curves to the lash for a voluminous lift thin brush tip grabs hard to reach in our lashes amplified base creates dramatic volume and curves no clumps Blah blah blah. I got the color I Rock Jet Black. Oh, packaging. I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see it, but it just says Rimmel and then Kate with a little heart. But look at this wand. This is very similar to the Rimmel. Ugh, I just threw it away. The Rockin' Curves, I think. It's the same exact wand, pretty much. Look at that. Look how big that is. Like, what? This is huge. Huge! I don't know what it is with Rimmel. I don't know why they feel like they need to make their wands absolutely ginormous. Bigger is not necessarily better. <laughs> so as you can probably tell, I do not have the mascara on right now. I'm wearing false lashes. I actually have the mascara on underneath these false lashes. It's on the wetter side and the wand is way too big. I mean, it did like a little bit. If you're looking for like a super natural look, then yeah, you know, it, it's okay. But the wand is just way too big and I don't know if you guys saw it in the first clip, I don't know if I kept it in or not, but I actually got it like on the inside of my eye. Just because the wand is so big, it's hard to maneuver around a little area. I think I might be done buying Rimmel mascaras because I've yet to find one that I actually really, really like. I feel like they're all the same. I feel like they're like, yeah, we're gonna make these wands huge and it's gonna give you tons of volume and it really doesn't do that. My overall thoughts, this mascara is nothing too special. I wouldn't waste your money on it. There's plenty of other mascaras that are way better than this. So that's it for today's Mascara Monday. As always, if you guys have a suggestion on a mascara that you want me to check out, comment down below and let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye! Bye! That was really high pitched! <laughs>